and welcome to my Everything Wrong With Jigsaw Review. So in this video, I'm going to tell you everything that is wrong with Jigsaw. Okay? So I'm going to tell you everything that I think is wrong with Jigsaw. Okay? So let's get started. Um, so this movie had a lot of problems with it. Okay? Um, but I probably not gonna, I probably not going to uh, find every de every problem with it, okay? Because um, because uh, that's the way it. I'm gonna just I'm gonna just find the problem, the wrong that I think the wrong in the movie, okay? So um, for one. They took so long to make another Star movie. It's been seven years since the last Star movie. So, you know, Star 3D or Star the Final Chapter, whatever you want to call it. You know, the last Star movie was called 3D, and then when it came to the DVD, it was called the Final Chapter, okay? Um, another, another wrong is it's like a reboot, okay? And I hate to say that, but the only the only original character in this movie is John Kramer, Flash, uh, Jigsaw. Yep. So yeah, you might hear you might hear some rumors or some theory or fan theory or anybody I'm going to the movie want to know is Adam gonna be in the movie from the very first Star movie, or is Doctor Gordon gonna be in the movie? Uh, that time we thought uh, Dr. Gordon was the uh, Star 3D or the, the, the Detective Hartman gonna be in the movie. You know, um, the answer is no. Like I said, like I already said was a second ago, uh, the only original character is Jigsaw. Okay? John Kramer. And you can't have a, a Star movie without John Kramer, Jigsaw, in the movie. And, uh, and he was dead, uh, he died in the third one, because he had cancer, and he, and he was pronounced dead in the fourth one, and, but he still had his videos, I mean, his voice, to have tape, throughout the other Star movie, and, and they brought him back to life, in this one, uh, so, you know, and the question is, uh, why did and a lot of people probably want to know why they made, made this one. It's a simple, simple question. The simple answer is because they want to make more money. And if they, they want to make more money, and why, why they wait seven years later to do that? And this is like a reboot. And to me, this is like a reboot, cause, you know, cause, cause to me, this wasn't really, really, really a thick one. The last one, but you know, no, no Adam, no, uh, no Adam from the first one, in this one, no Dr. Gordon, um, no Detective Hawkman, anything. To me, I would enjoy this a lot more if no, no, any of those characters came back in this one. Nothing. It was boring and wrong, and all new characters. You know they're going to a new direction to reboot the franchise. Wrong. And so I'm gonna say it again. Movie boring. Um, John Kramer the lie, the bomb about the lie. And and you you probably wonder well, how the bomb about the lie if he dead had cancer. Well, there's a thing in the movie where. Uh, there's a thing in the movie where uh, they explain where uh, the guy um, mis mis uh, interpret or how you say misplaced um, the X-ray wrong, and he and they put and they, he put his um, his cancer on his X-ray, and he wasn't he wasn't supposed to put his cancer thing on his X-ray. He was supposed to put can cancer on somebody else's X-ray. And and so so when go time to read 
So I claim an x-ray, it said that he had cancer. So all those years, John Kramer thought he had cancer, but, but, and then, there was this one thing where they go dig out the casket of the, of the grave of John Kramer, and he wasn't, he wasn't there, it was somebody else's body, so they brought him back to life, so, you know, you know, just boring, do dumb, like a dad, like a dad in my spoiler review, only trick of thing in the movie was, um, uh, when they opened the cat deck of John, of John Kramer, and he wasn't there, it was somebody else. And then there was another, and the other best thing in the movie, probably the best thing in the movie, where, uh, you know, the famous uh, coat that John Kramer wears in the, throughout the whole franchise, and he took his hood off, and you see him. And then there's a quote in the movie that someone said, he said, how can you, how can, how can you still be alive? And the simple answer is because people want to make money. And, and my theory is, how they want, why they want to make more money, seven years later when they should, uh, wait seven years later to make money. And then, then, no. Okay, it's a pathetic. And that, 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 that's a my So, okay. Um, so, um, yep, I, I, I hate to say, I hate to say it, but, you know, Adam, you know, Dr. Gordon, um, yep, but you're not gonna find anything, you're not gonna learn anything about that in, in, this, in this movie about Adam, um, uh, Dr. Gordon. Detective Hartman, if he's still dead, or did he get, somehow get out of the chain from Dog 3D. Um, not gonna anything out. They're all new fresh characters, except for, uh, Jip Doll. And John Kramer, because he has to be in it. If he's not in the movie, he cannot be a Jip Doll, a Jip Doll, I mean, you know, a Doll movie. And, um, uh, yep. That's my everything wrong with Jip Doll. And stay tuned, I'm going to do my ranking of all the movie, of all the, uh, all movie, and have them right here, and, and the, uh, in the box set, you know, like a little packing. I'll, I'll be ranking them. And thank you for watching my Everything Wrong with Jitto. Review. Thank you for watching.